The Good Samaritan, a kid's bedtime Bible story by Sammy Jameson. Once upon a time, in a land where hills rolled like cozy blankets, there was a winding road from Jerusalem to Jericho. Now, this road wasn't just any road. It was a rocky, twisty path that made travelers huff and puff like little steam engines. One sunny day, a Jewish man decided to take this bumpy journey. He hummed a merry tune, his sandals crunching on the pebbles. But oh dear, out of nowhere, some not-so-nice men leaped out like mischievous shadows. They snatched his bag, tore his clothes, and left him all bruised and bleeding by the roadside. Ouch! Soon, a priest came strolling along. Priests were like the church helpers, you see. But did he help our poor, hurt friend? Nope. He tiptoed to the other side of the road, pretending he didn't notice. Maybe he thought the man was taking a nap. Silly priest. Next up was a Levite. Levites were like priest helpers. Surely he'd lend a hand, right? Wrong. He slowed down, peeked at the man, and then tiptoed away. Not very neighborly, Mr. Levite. But wait, here comes our hero, the Samaritan. Now, Jews and Samaritans didn't get along like peanut butter and jelly. They were more like cats and dogs. But guess what? The Samaritan didn't care. When he saw the hurt man, his heart melted like warm butter on toast. He bandaged the man's wounds, lifted him onto his donkey, and took him to an inn. Take care of him, the Samaritan told the innkeeper. Here's some coins. If he needs more, I'll pay you back. And that, my readers, is how the Good Samaritan showed love. Jesus told this tale to teach us that being a good neighbor means helping anyone, even if they're different. So next time you see someone in need, be a Samaritan, kind, caring, and ready to lend a hand.